Hey, this is Justin, and I just wanted to share again one of the frustrations I have with the service. I want to like this service, um, but it just isn't doing anything. So this is quality roofing. I actually know these guys. Um, and obviously, if I do something here, it's not going to do anything. Um, but it did waste one of my searches. If I go to new search, and if I get rid of this, and I get rid of this, it's too much typing. And I type in... Um, their URL and get contact. It says, I need something here. If I don't know who I'm looking for, uh, maybe his name's Frank, maybe his name is Bob. I don't know. Now I have found if I put a space here and a space here, it'll at least run. And again, I've already run this, so it's going to waste another credit. I know I get 1500 a month or whatever, but they're not really worth anything because I'm getting nothing out of this. Um, now if I use, um, over here is uh, Hunter, uh, they give me three. And in fact, I know Isan. And uh, Rick, I think, is the actual owner. Uh, and I know his son, Tanner. Right. So, like, I, I don't understand. And that was in one click. It said, oh, let me pull this. Oh, you're on this page. Let's find the roofing stuff we can find. Give me the common taxonomy. Right. And it's not the same for all. I and mean, Isan doesn't have his last name because it's a it's a Arabic last name. that Most people would have a hard time spelling. But, <laughs> um you know, for a lot of people, that's going to be the pattern. So if I know that first dot last, and I say, oh, well, I know that Tanner works there. So I'll bet it's tanner.jenkins at qualityroofing.net. And sure enough, I find some information. I have 150 requests this month. I've never gone over that because I know how to find email addresses normally anyway. I just use this as kind of like a, if I'm lazy or if I'm in a hurry or something, I'll, I'll click on this and, and whatnot. So uh, if you guys could figure out, like, like, do you have plans with this um, find the lead extension? To, to do this sort of stuff or like, is it just going to basically be what it is now? Like, I really want to know what your long-term goals are because that's going to make a big difference on whether I refund on AppSumo or not. Cause I currently, I feel like it's a waste of 39 bucks. Uh, I really have gotten very, very little actual utility, uh, out of it. Um, let me f let's see, find that lead. Let's see if this will let me in while I'm still recording here, stay in this tab. Um, so like I've done a few searches and let me sign in with my LinkedIn account. There we go. Go to my dashboard. So one of your big features was we got access to the prospector, right? Oh, shoot. It just backed me out. Do it again. There we go. Go to dashboard. All right. So I've run this a couple times. I was looking for you know, HVAC contractors in Albuquerque. So let's just take a look at what I got there. Uh, and it said that there were seven. I only see four. Um, and two of them are junk. <laughs> Call in investments. There's not even a website here. Like I have no idea why that was there. Um, and this guy's owner, it's Usan is like a network marketing company. <laughs> um, so why these ones turned up, I have no idea. Uh, Chris Meyer of Williams Mechanical, that's often uh, good. Now, I can tell you right now, um, he's probably, just because they use the word mechanical, he's probably uh, commercial only. And then Bishop Radiant Heating Systems. This one is very possibly decent, right? Um, so let me close this out of the way here. And let me click on this one and let's just generate that email and see what happens. Uh, if you leave the prospector or close the tab, you will lose your emails and credits. Click on email generation if you want to stop the process. Okay, good. Um, so it's going to sit there and and it's going to work on this. Let's see what it shows up for, for William Biswell. And meanwhile, while this is doing it, I'm going to come over here and you won't be able to see this because I'm recording in a different tab. I want to do Hunter again and see what it turns up. Now, Hunter on this one turned up nothing. So if you guys turn up something, you'll have beaten them at least once. But gosh, that takes a long time too, right? Um, and I'm not convinced you're going to show up with anything, but I'm, I'm willing to give you the benefit of the doubt. Uh, not found, <laughs> right? Um, and so what I could do is, and this is actually, I can tell already, it's not even the right kind of site for me. Um, copy, paste, I'm doing this window. So I can go to who is, it's probably got domain privacy on. I'm sure you guys look at this, but you know, it's one of my very first steps is always come here and see if I can find somebody. And I'll actually sometimes actually like hand copy this whole thing out and email them to it if I need to, because it will get to them if I email them through that, uh, that thing. And I'll, you know, I'll go to their Facebook page and I'll go to other, like there's so many different pages you can go to get uh, email. Um, gosh, and this keeps logging me out now too. I don't know why that is. Um, I understand that you use cookies 
and I'm signing in again through my LinkedIn account. And I'm going again to my dashboard. And then this one, contractor CEO, is apparently 1400 um, But if I go in here and take a look at it, um, oh, it's going to have to reload them all very slowly. Anyway, I find that this service, I hate to say it, very, um, very frustratingly underwhelming. Um, and I want to know what your long-term plans are. Um, so this was looking for just contractors in general. Oh, and the other thing with your prospector is like you need more diversification. So for instance, uh, what industry are they in? And I know you're probably going to LinkedIn or something, but um, let's check all the, all the, I can't do it on the screen anyway. So like as deep as it goes is construction, right? So if I want to find a roofer, then, you know, the best I can do is go to construction and go from there. Now I have found at least, now it's going to, it's going to actually lose some, but if I look up maybe company name along with company industry and then I continue. So the industry would be construction, that's as deep as you go. Um, but then the company name has roofing or roof in it. I click continue and then we'll try roofing demo. Now this is going to get me, you know, roofing supply companies as well. And it, it takes a long time. So anyway, I'm not trying to be persnickety. I'm not trying to insult you guys. I know it takes a lot of work to make a tool like this. And I want to like your tool. I really do. I was very excited about the actual AppSumo offer. Um, but ever since I've been using it, uh, I've just not been having good luck. Oh, I didn't, I didn't put on location. Of course. Now I've got like United Arab Emirates and, uh, whatnot. So that actually is kind of silly. Um, yeah, cooling towers. I mean, that's India, but anyway, so that's, that's kind of my frustration that I'm having right now. And, uh, yeah, let me know. Thanks guys. Let me, let me know what's going to change. Let me know if you can bring in this kind of functionality where I can just click because it's really obnoxious. I can't do it again. Uh, it's really, really obnoxious if I have to come to a site and then I have to press the button and then it says this, right? Unless, unless it would say this on a site where it can get it. So like if I click it and it automatically populates when it can, and this is just a really quick way of letting me know we got nothing, right? But I don't think that's the case. Um, in fact, let me, I could find one really quickly where I've got, uh, and there it is logging me out again. Uh, try lead manager. Okay. So P at call path the plumber. That's not correct, but whatever. So if I come over here and let's just go back to um, just copy this and do it in this window. Cause again, I'm just recording this one tab. Uh, I think I've shown this to you guys before. If I click on Hunter, uh, and I've already done this one. So, Hey, look, Pat at call Pat, the plumber, that makes sense. And they're not going to charge me again for that search because I've already done it, which I think is really cool. But if I do you guys and I click this, unable to find, unable to find, unable to find. And if I clear these out, put that in here, obviously you're not going to do anything because I haven't put in a name. I'm going to assume it's Pat. Uh, and I'm going to click your contact and it's not going to work because I got to have something here. I'm going to put a space or, uh, yeah, I'm going to put a space there, which I shouldn't have to do and click get contact. And the best you can find is P space at call Pat the plumber. So, you know, and I wasted eight searches doing this video for you guys or whatever. I don't really care about the searches. Um, you know, it, theoretically I shouldn't need that many in a month. Um, but uh, just, I, I don't know. Let me know. Let me know what's happening with the service because I, I want to like it. I really do. I want to be, I, I, I have bought, you know, almost 80 app sumo deals and I'm usually very, very involved with the developers of all the different deals. Um, because when I have a product I like, uh, I want to use it and I want it to be successful. And so this is, this is my reaching out to you guys to help you be as successful as possible. Um, just as a, as a user. So I hope that makes sense. Let me know if it does and I'll be in touch. Thank you.